everybody, welcome back to another video. Today I'm joined with my BFFL and roommate, Sam, who is just a figure in the background. Always crittering and disappearing. You can't just her behind me, you're too tall. <laughs> like, so. Hopefully. Here's the deal. I really wanted to make this into a multi-part series of me removing a lot of books from my bookshelves, doing two bookshelves at a time. But we just got word that we're able to get out of this lease early, which means that we're moving out sooner. So we're going to have to do some rush Marie condoing. If you do not know what that means, she's pretty much just tidying up master from Japan. She has a show on Netflix called Tidying Up, and she very much inspires a lot of people to get rid of a lot of clutter in their house. So pretty much Sam and I are moving out. Well, we have to actually pack up everything within the next two weeks and we move out at the end of March, which kind of means we have to get rid of the books pretty quickly now. So we're just going to go through the bookshelf, get rid of the books that I just do not need anymore, and then we're going to follow up this video with another video of me sharing with you guys what books I'm getting rid of. Mm -hmm. Cool. So let's get started and start tidying up our bookshelves. And if you haven't seen the last video I did, I'll be linking it down below. I looked way nicer in that one. So, I want Origin. I want Miss Warren. I don't need that in the end. I want that. Last yeah. test was not great. That one's good. That was good. I like that. Don't need contemporaries. Do you want to start with that bookshelf too? Yeah. Zena. No, I'm just get rid of that book. I don't need that book. Mm -mm. Max's story? Yeah, you can take that out. What could his story even be? Like what? Just being is adorable. His story? Like a little dog in a big city. Oh, oh my god! I want that dog. I'm what is this? I don't need any more dogs. I can't even read this because I'm blind. Sam, don't you have your contacts in? Yeah, but like I'm blind from your light. Oh. I'm blind from that. <laughs> my bad. Thing. My bitch ass eyes can't read because of this. Oh my god, where did you even find this? I think I got like sent it by a publisher. Okay, I only need one kite runner. A dog's way home? Why are two dog books? I don't know why I have so many dog books. I honestly don't. Why? Because you love to hate me, Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no, another one. <laughs> Magnolia? Why is this upside down? Uh, is it Magno Mag Magnolia? Mm. Magonia. Magonia. Yeah, I read that wrong. <laughs> Mag Magnolia? Uh. <sighs> I have a Sherwin Kenyon book. I recommend that you guys look her up on Google because there's like some scandals going on. Which one? Prisoner of the Night Pop. Oh, I love that one. Finale. Which one? Finale. No. I'm getting rid of all my Lauren Kate books. I do not need. Deadly Little Secret. Uh, Immortal City. Oh, Marissa. oh yeah, I read the book. It, it's not too bad, but like he never followed up with another book, I think. Of books and bagpipes. If that isn't on brand, I don't know what it is. Fault in Our Stars. Giveaway. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, no, 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 I think that one's signed. Unless I know, I think he had the sign one away. But I feel like it's such a staple. Yeah, even though I don't like his other books. God, I think that you need to keep the pirate and his lady. Yeah, we need to keep we that. We need to keep that. The worst book in existence right here, guys. We're gonna keep it, I though. still think we should read that. I honestly think, like, just like a live reading. Mm -hmm. Like, uh, cringe. That's cringe. Like, seriously, that's cringe. Alchemist. We should do that's Blue. cringe, but, like, bookish edition. Yeah. Like so far, there's none that you're giving away that I want. I know, you want. <laughs> <No. laughs> Meanwhile, you live with me, you can read them at any time. <laughs> Yeah, Book of Shadow Time, a Shadow One, um, Takeaway Endgame, and the End Times, whatever that is. All of that missing. Takeaway Catacomb and Keep Asking Us. The rest is gonna stay. And then take Future Shock away. I don't know why I have so many Future Shock books. I'm done with this shelf. Unfortunately, my mom's death is not crazy. 
smile. Okay guys, so as you saw in the last time lapse, we have moved all the shelves into one concentrated area behind me. We have organized what books we're going to keep and which ones we're going to give away. And stay tuned for next video where I go through all the books that are for giveaway because it's a whole lot of them. There's a, two huge piles right there, there's another one right behind me, and then below me, there's a huge box of books. So guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye!